Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new, welcome to Redesign 16. So this is where I post about beauty, fashion, and lifestyle so every single week. Before we get started on this Giddy Up Lip Sense application, please like this video and please hit the subscribe button. So let's jump right into it. Hey everyone, so I am hopping on to try a new lip sense to me. It's an oldie but goodie. It's called Giddy Up. I have mixed feelings about this. I wanted, like I definitely want to try it out and see how it looks, but I'm also scared because it's kind of a purpley color. But sometimes the when you're scared of something, trying something new, it's actually the best thing. So it could turn out to be the best thing. If you have never heard of lip scents, Lip Scent is a liquid lip color that is equal up to three tubes of regular lip stick. So this, once it is, or once it's applied, once it's applied, it is sponge proof, kiss proof. It lasts from four to 18 hours. It's wax free, light free, cruelty free, vegan free. Uh, Gluten free, made in the U.S., not tested on any animals, doesn't have any animal products in it. When you apply it, you want clean, uh, dry lips so that no makeup or no food gets in them. Um, you want to do three thin layers in the same direction that you start with. And then once each layer is dry and you get to the third layer, like before you can go in between and r touch it up if you want to. But after the third layer, once it is dry to the touch, you want to seal it in with glossy gloss. Glossy gloss is a must because if you don't, it's going to be all tacky and stuff like that. So you want to make sure that it is applied correctly. So. I don't know about you, but I rather apply my lipstick once and not have to keep reapplying it every time after I eat. Yes, I do gloss before I eat um, because it like makes it stay better or something. I don't know. It's just my preference. You don't have to do that. So I'm taking a wet rag and doing it like this. So you want to make sure that all of the makeup and food are off because if you don't, it won't apply right. So I like I can testify to this four to eighteen hours. I've worn colors for more than twenty four hours because I was so tired. So if you have not checked out my short videos, please do go over there and check them out and view them. I am so blown away. There are so many new faces around here. Welcome. This is what I love to do, to bring people what my passion is, which is makeup, uh, fashion, and beauty. Um, and that's what I'm here for. So, okay. Also, before you start with, if it's a brand new tube or you've used it 10 times, um, you want to shake it up and that noise is actually a bead mixing up your color. It's pretty cool. So, I am going to do uh my finish up my makeup in between so also when you're applying it you're as a trend your lips cannot touch so I'm trying to find my here is, my translucent powder so that I can do it underneath my eyes so this is brand new sealed never been open so here i go and we love 
that clicking noise. And I will put a link down below so that you can shop. And also, if you want a discount at the checkout, you click right before you check out that or click that checkout button. You want to click the box that says preferred Kiss and Tell program or Kiss and Tell customer. Click that and get 10% off all your purchases if you live in the US. If you don't, I can still help you out. Send me a message over on my Instagram account at redesign16 uh, and say I need help with discount or something like that. So, and if you spend $100 and you click that button, it would be $10 extra, you would get free shipping uh, samples and your products. If you spend 150 you get a gift, samples, your products, it's a win-win. So that's like if you spend $100 within a month or 150 within a month. And if you have budget, I can totally work with that too. So before you apply each layer, you want to wipe off all of the excess on the tube and you want to go in the same direction that you start with but when you apply the um, last glass you don't have to go in the same direction and you kind of don't want to go back and forth so here I go okay that's not bad. Not bad at all. All of the excess. Okay, there's the first layer. It's not bad. It is kind of purple, but it's not bad. So. Okay. You want to make sure it's dry to the touch which it is, so layer two, your lips can't touch, and I just did, so don't do that, layer two, oh yeah, I'm kind of going back and forth, wow, I kind of like it, There's a layer two. It's not bad. Not bad at all. See that right there? Okay. That's layer two. Now, where am I going to scare? This is 
layer three. So I had There's layer C. There's a layer three. Gonna go back in with the scare. Some colors take more time than others. Okay. Still a little tacky. like I said, five to 10 seconds. And I will show you, this is just a clear gloss. There's nothing on my wand. If there is, it's because I didn't wait long enough. Okay, dry to the touch. You want to rub your lips together. And there you go. I like it, but I don't know. I have to get used to it. I don't know. It's a lot like the, if you've been around for a while, it's a lot like the mini uh, boss gloss which is sold out and I do have that when I'll probably do a video on it hopefully it will come back hopefully Synergens will bring it back but yeah and if you don't like the glossy 
Look, we also have satin matte gloss, and we have gloss gloss, and a matte gloss, satin matte gloss. So, and a little trick is to rub it in so it's not so glossy. But there's nothing on my rag just from when I um, opened it or opened it, did the wiping it off. So there's nothing on it. Okay, this is like the real test. Voila, nothing. It is amazing. It's trans, like it doesn't transfer. You can eat, you can drink coffee. It is amazing, like totally amazing. So I am going to finish up here and come back with the end result for you guys. So I'm back with the end result and this is how Giddy Up turned out. I like it, but it's a bit bold for me so I don't know maybe I'll get used to it I don't know so I think it goes perfect with this eye color that I did and I if you haven't seen that hop on over to pretty eyeshadow shadow sense look or something shadow sense pretty look I don't know what I'm gonna call it yet so but yeah I I like it, but I don't know. It's a little dark for me. I thought, while I was doing the video, I thought, this would be a perfect color for Halloween. And Halloween's not that far away. So, I don't know. I like it. So, uh, don't forget to like this video, hit the subscribe button, and or please like this video. That's what I'm trying to say. Please like this video. Please uh, hit the subscribe button and don't forget to ring the bell before you leave so that you will be notified every time I post a uh, new video or a short video. First come, first serve. Thanks for watching.